Okay. Said I'd get up at 3, 3.30 a.m. Just like Tristan. And that's my secret to waking up at 3.30 a.m. I just don't go to sleep. This guy's actually awake and texting me. I thought all YouTubers were liars, but he actually does wake up at 3 a.m. I guess now I'm gonna take a freezing cold shower and spread my ass cheeks in the direction of the morning sun. I don't think there's gonna be a sun today though, because it's winter. Maybe I'll just spread my ass cheeks. You know how hardworking this guy is? He sent me a work-related text message at 3.30 a.m. Harley hasn't gone to sleep yet. He's still screaming at some 12-year-old on the internet. Best believe I f***ed him up, dog. Look at him. Ah, babes. <laughs> That's my motivation right now. Me too, one day. Really drive by. Let's get two more. Come on. Yes. Perfect. One more. Before we get into any of the video, I just want to make it clear. It's all angles. He's not actually taller than me. I'm actually 6'5". Yeah. I'm actually 7'8". So he is 6'5". We just got a great workout in, and now I'm here with Tristan in my fucking kitchen. We're gonna make an epic meal. I'm talking about a savage Big Mac. We got some ground bison meat. We got some bones. We got some bison steaks. We got chicken livers in the sink. We got all this because Tristan's a savage and he actually only eats what? Meat, salt, and water. water. That's fucking hardcore. So I'm out here doing the show every Tuesday. This motherfucker's living it. So I'm gonna try and keep up with him today in the kitchen after trying to keep up with him in the gym. So let's make this savage Big Mac happen right now. You ready? Let's do it. Oh, shit. Listen, we're here to lift weights, but if someone pulls up and they want a 1v1 on Russ, yeah. ready to go, bro. I want to stay hydrated as well, but I'm just saying, if someone wants to place a street fighter with me right now, let's go, man. I'm ready. Head to gfuel.com. Pick yourself any flavor you like and get up to 30% off when you use the code EPIC at checkout. Keeps you focused, keeps you energized, keeps you hydrated. Go to gfuel.com, check them out yourself. Let me know what your favorite flavors of G Fuel are. All right, come over here, tell Tristan what we got. We got some bison steak over here. We got some bone marrow. We're gonna extract the marrow, make some bone marrow Big Mac sauce, bacon as in tradition. Here we got our two buns. We gotta disassemble, extract, and make our Big Mac bun. You have to buy two because you gotta cut them in half and you wanna make sure that you get a good middle bun. You can't cheat that guy. Do you understand there's a middle bun on a Big Mac? I've never had a Big Mac in my life. You never had one in your life? <gasps> What do you need me and Tristan doing right now? If you guys want to co-op lay some bacon strips, you can. Did you do that? Yes, they, they, those, those buns are so heavy, the bag is a lie. Yeah, the bag is a lie. I know you say you like your bacon crispy, so we got the oven set to convect. And the best way to cook bacon for mass consumption purposes is the oven. Bro, this guy cooks more bacon than we do. You don't need to talk to him like that. We're dealing with actually someone perhaps a bit more savage than us today. We're like, oh, we got the bacon and the liver. And he's like, where's the tongue? Where's the brains? Where's the heart? I do liver all the time. Liver is the best because it makes you actually feel good feel it running through your veins. I do heart, tongue. I'm still trying to find some testicles in Canada. That's really difficult. So if anybody out there, any of you guys knows where I can find some balls, please, please hit me up. But I'll do, I'll do organ meats multiple times a week. And then other than that, it's just uh, all meat, salt, water. So we were gonna have a big ass tomahawk this episode. Tristan actually is sitting on a fat ass 105 ounce tomahawk. Biggest retail tomahawk for sale. Uh, so guys at home, cause it's not here, close your eyes. Imagine the steak. Wrong, bitch. Whatever you just imagined, it's bigger than that. But it was so big it didn't even thaw. But that's not even a bad thing because I actually f***ing love bison. Because everybody knows Big Mac comes with one slice of cheese. Since we're making a larger than life Big Mac, we got to make a custom cheese slice. I know what I'm doing. But do you know what you're doing? You're hitting the subscribe button, even though it doesn't matter. So I want you to do it because I have a mental illness. I've unintentionally attached my happiness to the number located beneath the channel that says subscribers. Subscribe. Right? Yeah. Notifications on. Got experience making patties? Got a little bit of experience. Come come over here and make a nice patty for us. Now don't manhandle the meat too much because then it won't be usable after. Don't exactly. beat my meat. Don't beat the meat. Exactly. You got it. And that's a great takeaway for you guys at home if you want to get on that level and be peeled like a cosmetic chemical treatment, you're gonna wanna beat your meat, never finish. I'm three weeks straight beating my meat three times a day, never ever finishing. Me and Tristan are gonna do a dopamine detox after this. We're gonna sit in the dark for 45 days. Well, we're gonna come out of that darkness, the sunlight is gonna hit us, and we are going to nut. What's so crazy about this is I literally followed this guy when he was a child, and now I'm talking about his balls. Call the cops on me right now. You didn't do it? 
my boy. Oh yeah, this is the grossest thing you can ever touch. That looks fucked up, nasty, bad. Primal Big Mac. We got our strips of bacon all done, just waiting to be prepared. We got our bone marrow down here. We've got our bison patties, which are absolutely massive. I think they're three pounds each. Then we've got some chicken livers and onions on top. The bison steaks here, I had to cook it myself because you know, we're just seasoning with literally just salt, no dairy, no other shit, no spices or pepper. I may have fucked Harley's pan up a little bit. He said it's fine, so. But I have no loyalty for that pan at all. Yeah. Fuck that pan. All right, here we got our bone marrow. Make bone marrow mac sauce. Crevice, that's the gold right there. So this is in the Epic Meal Time kitchen right now. We're making this savage Big Mac right here with organs and Big Mac bone sauce. We got a ton of bacon on it. We're going crazy. But in a huge swerve, we made a custom selection of food on the side because Tristan only eats meat and salt. Water. And water. He eats his water. You're never gonna have a strong jawline by drinking water. I'm gonna have to bring the calorie counter back for this episode. It's just, I'm just way too curious how many calories that Savage Big Mac is, how many grams of protein are in there. I need to know. I don't even know how I'm gonna bite this. So that's it. We got this big ass Savage Big Mac with bison burger inside, bacon, bone marrow Big Mac sauce. I'm fucking up today. That's the truth. There's a big fuck up right here. You, you just not really. I just got right. steak and lover. Literally and bone marrow. This whole adventure for me, and it's just Wednesday for you. Tuesday. What day is it? Doesn't matter. Okay, hey, cheers. I know you want some salt, too. 100% you want some salt. Bone marrow is so good. It really is. I literally could eat this, like, all day. I'm having a great time right now eating this. I, you know, I didn't always expect that, like, the chicken liver Big Mac sauce is gonna be banger, but it is. This is sick. It's so good. What's the verdict, chef? Does it taste like a Big Mac? That's the question. Mm -hmm. Close enough, for sure. I'm eating so much fucking Big Mac chicken liver right now. With I'm also eating, like, way more than I even expected this shit. Yeah, this is good. I'm gonna be eating this for a week. We got the workout in, went to the gym and had a killer back day. And then we banged out an epic meal, had a great time. I said, next time we eat 105 ounce tomahawk, two of them at the gym. Oh. USA is not Cereal. fucking around. See this is a mirror? It's my favorite food, you know that? If someone, if someone came and they were like, what's your favorite food? Tell me I'm gonna suck your dick. I'd be like, uh, cereal. I mean, I'd be like, uh, I don't know. You don't even look at this shit, eh? You, go, you don't even go into the supermarket. You go, you go to a man who, who has a big knife and he cuts a piece off a creature and gives it to you. <laughs> and then you go to your block of salt.